This past December, despite a wealth of scientific evidence to the contrary, British Columbia moved to ban all grizzly bear hunting in the province. The reason for the ban, as stated in a BC government news release, is that, and I quote, the government's consultation with many British Columbians who have declared the hunt is not in line with their values. Certainly, the Guides and Outfitters Association of British Columbia was not invited into this consultation and decried this political, not science-based decision, stating, again, and I quote, it is truly disappointing that we throw history and science out the window for some urban votes. We expect our government to make informed decisions based on facts and science. Emotional decisions are not good for anyone. This is just the latest instance where wildlife policy around the globe has been implemented in an effort to gain political capital while placating a well-funded, extreme, and vocal anti-hunting minority. This new assault on legal, science-based, ethical, and tightly controlled big game hunting is just the latest example of politics over science as it relates to wildlife issues. Whenever wildlife issues are decided by popular polls or political agenda in place of scientific analysis, the outcome is predictable. Wildlife loses. Dallas Safari Club and the DSC Foundation will continue to fund science-based wildlife research and be a leading voice in reporting the wisdom of science over politics as wildlife policies are shaped in the future.